Hey guys, how's it going? Our right, Green Star here with an interesting unboxing today. So, uh, I was at Comic Con this last weekend, and uh, one of the uh, booths there was this toy. I think it's that says Toys K. I don't know, Toy and K. Whatever it is, had these mystery boxes there. Now the price point on these were um, $59.99 a piece, so we picked up two. And um, this came as a free bonus, so I'll pop that as well. So, um, they also had a bunch of other boxes. Um, oh, just like like random game boxes, and like video game boxes and anime and all kinds of different ones. This one seemed to be the one that looked good. So, haven't. So we'll just crack them open and see what I get. All right. So, let's see what the first thing I get. Okay, the first thing I get is a... Plants vs. Zombies toy it is a Tomb Raider zombie and, and Bloomerang. I, I will say that I am a fan of uh, Plants vs. Zombies too. I've played the game quite a bit. Alright, oh, let's throw it over there. What do we get? Uh, chicken and an egg. This, let's see, is it open? Okay, I'm going to open it. It is, oh, it's Harvest Moon. Okay, so this is 10th anniversary of Harvest Moon. So there's a, a Harvest Moon chicken. I've not played the game, but I've heard it's really good. Um, I probably should have back in the days when I owned the GameCube. So plushy. All right. Um, hmm. So we get uh, what is this? Um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles shot glasses. Four mini shot glasses, one of each. They're kind of shiny. They are. They are glass. It's kind of cool. Got the the original. Um, I don't know. What would you say on? I'm just trying to think about like a price. Like these are probably like a ten dollars. The the zombies is probably like a four dollar toy. The chicken is probably I don't know four dollars. Uh, let's go for the big one last. Uh, oh cool! What we got here? Another turtles thing. Uh, this is a a fleece throw. So we have a fleece throw. Uh, that's kind of cool. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Let's crack it open and see what it is. How it looks. Oh, really soft. That's pretty cool. I mean, it is supremely soft. So if I'm going to keep this for myself, because why not? Let's see how big this thing is. Let's get this out of here. Seems pretty big. Alright, it's all put together with the little plastic pieces. They'll have to eventually come out. Alright, check it out. Probably it'll be tough to see, but it's actually pretty... I mean, I'm 6'2". It comes up to my, my neck. It's actually pretty solid. I don't know how much you can see. I'll do my best to show you. Oh, it's caught. Sure. Come on, jerk. All right, there we go. Yeah, it's actually a pretty good, pretty good throw. All right, like I said, it is really soft. That's nice. All right, that's a good throw. What do throws like that go for? Probably ten, twelve dollars, maybe more. All right, we got. Um, it is a doctor and be the tenth doctor. Uh. It is a journal. It includes the Master's Ring. Cool. The Journal of the Impossible Things and the Master's Ring. So it looks like a leather brown, leather bound journal. Now, as I know how Doctor Who things go, yeah, generally pretty expensive for what you get. Um, but that's really cool. I have a friend who will love that, so she's getting that. That's probably <laughs> that's <laughs> what it should be worth. About five. What it is worth, I mean, they probably sell in the store since it is licensed BBC, probably 10. We got in here a couple more things. A Domo deck of playing cards. That's kind of cool. It's like $2. Ooh, a Green Lantern Ugly Doll plushie. Kind of cute. A little different. It's a DC character, at least. It does have a ring, which is kind of nice. I'm a fan of DC, of course. 
and a uh, Transformer Series 2 Action Vinyl. Um, the Loyal Subjects. I don't see Fire Chief. Who is that? I don't... Weird. Um, Red Alert. But they have... <laughs> it's really strange that, that there's like Decepticon logos, but he, Red Alert's an Autobot. That's kind of cool. Wish it would actually be a Transformer. And one more piece in here. Oh, that's cool. Is a... We're going to open this right up. A Batman plushy Domo. <laughs> that's crazy. Cool. Limited edition Batman plushy Domo. Does this tell me this isn't a sticker? Nope, it's not a sticker. It's actually pretty cool. It'll probably stand pretty well, too. That's cool. All right. Well, that's a decent amount of stuff. Cool box. Let's get this one going. Let's see what we get in here. like less stuff. Start off with this. What is this? A Stanley Stanley vinyl. It's kind of cool. A little Stanley vinyl. I wonder if they bought out like a old <laughs> an old GameStop or something. It's an old that's a Stanley vinyl. That's kind of neat looking though. He, like, he's got glasses on since Stanley is freaking everywhere. It'd be a lot cooler if this was signed. Right, we can go over there. I have a Blink, oh, Blink in your den. A, uh, a grocery bag. You can own those. Almost like a record bag. It's Doctor Who, and it would be the um, uh, the Weeping Angels. That's kind of cool. Another bag. It's actually a little bit nicer quality than your average ones, but it is kind of skinny. It's almost like a record bag. You can fit records in there. Bring them along, you know, like vinyl. Bring your vinyl collection somewhere. All right, that's pretty cool. Oh, we get another Plants vs. Zombie figure. Um, sure. I don't care about that, really. I don't know. I get another chicken. Uh, I don't care about that, either. <laughs> I mean, they're fine, whatever. All right, what's this? Um, this is a Mr. Robot. A Mr. Robot mask. It's actually sturdy plastic. Really hard plastic. Comes with that. That's kind of neat. You know, F Society, um, I, I have yet to watch Mr. Robot. I've heard good things about it, just have not watched it. This isn't your average, like, really cheap plastic. It's actually pretty hard plastic. You can hear it's like a hockey mask almost. Probably would wear it for hockey. Oh, what do we got? Okay. Mm, it says Sherlock. It's a lanyard. It's a Sherlock lanyard. Get Sherlock. So you see, it's a Sherlock lanyard. That's kind of cool. I'm going to open it because I'm going to keep it. I don't know if you've seen the BBC show Sherlock. Um, I have watched it, and I really like it a lot. I'm a big fan. Really nice. Very um, very soft lanyard, which is kind of nice. Get Sherlock. Cool. Put the put my tag in there. I actually have all these for work, so there's stuff. I oh, get a big glass. I don't know what this is? I can see something through the middle of it. Oh, there's a knife in the it. Oh. It is actually glass. Cartoon Network. funky check that out yeah it's glass that's pretty cool now unfortunately i do not watch a whole lot of um nickelodeon cartoons so i can't tell you who this is i recognize the face from somewhere but ah, it escapes me can't microwave it it's got a lot of you have to hand wash it, it has to be my it can't be microwave it means a glass <laughs> it's a cool looking glass i like it so it's going into my collection but whatever no that's just bad um uh, I got another turtle's blanket. Um, that's cool. I'll do something with that. Oh, got a couple things. 
um, that little thing. All right, Doctor Who phone case for <laughs> for a Galaxy S3. Anyone have a Galaxy S3 anymore? Do you have a Galaxy S3? I don't have a Galaxy S3. I have a Note 5, but not a Galaxy S3. Well, um, that's pretty much totally worthless. So, cool. Alright, the last one is this little guy. This is our bonus box. Let's check what we got. There's a t-shirt. It is, uh, as you can see, it is a Minecraft t-shirt. Um, okay, uh, so what are my thoughts on this box, or these boxes? Um, my favorite was piece out of it was probably the Domo Batman. That's pretty cool. Being a comic collector, that would be the piece I would most... Or that I most enjoy. Um, after that, gosh, the blanket was kind of nice. Um, the glasses, the shot glasses were fine. I don't know. I mean, there was nothing in there that was overly special. I don't feel like I need any of it. Nor would I pay that price for it. Um, split two with my buddy, and uh, he gave me one. So, or gave me his because he didn't want. He just decided he didn't want one. Um, so yeah, well. That was from the company. You could see it right there. That is a discount code. So if you really dug it, you really like it, thought it was good value, pick it up. This will give you 10% off. Oh, it's Toy NK. There it is, Toy NK. Uh, me personally, I mean, not a Funko Pop in there. Not anything like licensed toys besides the, the Transformers ones. The, the Doctor Who stuff was fine, but it was just stuff. It wasn't really anything special. All kind of cheap. So, I, I give it, at best, a C. Just an okay. It's just okay. Not my style. Not my stuff. I prefer, like, the Loot Crate stuff. And I feel like that's pretty high-quality stuff. So, all right. Well, um, thanks for watching. Uh, tell me what you think in the comments. If you thought any of it was, uh, like, if you think I'm crazy and think this was a great box, let me know. Tell me. Um, or if you think I'm right on the money. <laughs> Probably not worth, $100, like, $59 a box. Um, <laughs> let me know about that, too. Uh, subscribe if you dig the videos. I'm doing a whole bunch of them. Um, and what else? Uh, dig the video. You like it. Give it a like. Uh, check out my Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And I guess that's about it. So I will see you later.